Renowned American street artist Futura created some 30 specially commissioned pieces while on a two-week residency at local private art space and salon, The Culture Story. And these works are set to be on display at Gilman Barracks starting Thursday. Constellation will be Futura's first, first, very first solo art exhibition in Southeast Asia. He used a range of materials coupled with finely tuned techniques to create bold, vibrant compositions marked by a repertoire of forms and iconic motifs that he has come to be known for. And for more American street artist Futura and the founder of the culture story, Ning Chong, join us in studio. Good to see you both here this evening. Welcome. Thanks Thank for you. Having us. Thanks so, for Futura, us. let's let's start off with you. You'll be showcasing 30 pieces of works uh, that you've created here in Singapore. Can you tell us a little bit more about them? Mm. Yeah, um, you know, it's I would say a kind of an ensemble of the different sort of styles I have created over my career, but primarily, you know, it's brand new work. It's uh, I think it's quite exciting, colorful, technical. And I'm really grateful to, to Ning for allowing me to, you know, have this exhibition here. And Ning, what made you decide on, on choosing Futura to, to come and showcase? Well, we were in New York in uh, November 2017 and we did a couple of studio visits. Mm. And after spending two hours with Futura, that was the first time we met him, uh, my parents and I were just struck by the quality of his work. Mm. Uh, we were just so taken by the colors. Um, the, the composition, you know, the, it was just incredibly vibrant and fresh. And we thought to ourselves, how come we haven't seen his work in this part of the world? Mm -hmm. um, so after nine months of courtship, he finally said yes. <laughs> and here we are today. So street art is a, is a very organic type of, of art form. And yes. I know that you had some experience of it growing up. So does, yeah. that, does that resonate through the work that you do today? What inspires you? You know, back then, and I think uh, from New York's historical point of view, it's almost like a 50-year-old movement. It dates back to the late 60s. But it's just about self-expression mm -hmm. and, more importantly, I think communication through whatever the medium. You know, obviously everyone's in the arts, you know, dance, film, photography, uh, painting, illustration. But for me, you know, it's just as important today to express myself as it was when I was a teenager. Fortunately, I'm better at it, and hopefully I have some, something interesting to show the public at large. I mean, you discovered uh, Futura for yourself uh, two years ago, as you said, in 2017. What is it you're hoping that the audience here in Singapore will, will come away with? So the title of the show is called Constellation, and it's also a nod to um, Futura when he first came to Singapore in 1974, and he was actually a young Navy officer on the U.S. Uh, supercarrier called the... Um, Kitty constellation. Hawk. constellation. Well, it's a, it's a Kitty Hawk class That's carrier, right. but yes, it's a constellation. So we're hoping that um, the public, the audiences in Singapore will take an interest to in street art. Uh, it's, it's as a genre, as a movement, it's gained um, incredible momentum um, worldwide. And hopefully um, in history books, they will refer to Constellation as, as one, one to look out for. Mm. There's very often so much passion, so much color, authenticity to street art. Was it tough to make, you know, the transition from street art to, to gallery work mm. at all? Yeah, I mean, that probably occurred in the early 80s when artists like myself, Keith Herring, Jean-Michel Basquiat, Donnie White, Ramel Z, you know, we were all transitioning from quote-unquote underground artists to legitimate gallery spaces. You know, very hard for me, especially because I'm not formally trained. You know, I didn't go to art school. So when references of fine art are being made to my work, I'm kind of like, you know, who's that? <laughs> so it was hard and it was intimidating, but I persevered like I do. You know, I'm a, I just have a, I don't want to say enormous self-confidence, but I believe in what I'm doing. And so fortunately, you know, you close your eyes, you blink, and 30-something years later, you're having a, a, a show in, in Singapore. Yeah. So it, something must have worked. And how does it feel to, to come back after all this time? Amazing. You know, I mean, first of all, I, I, you know, when I came 45-ish years ago, it wasn't the landscape we see today. You know, the reclaimed land, the beachfront that's now been extended, you know, all of the architecture, you know, I mean, except for obviously the classic Singapore shop houses, which are amazing. So mm. a lot has changed, sure, you know, but I still remember that 
seeing the lion, you know, the mirror lion or whatever, like on arrival and being like, wow, you know, what a tropical paradise <laughs> this place is. So, yeah. And I'm representing, you know, I'm yeah, so... Yeah, we, we couldn't help but notice that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah. props flag. to your guys' squad and, you know, I support. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. yeah. yeah and Ning, I just yeah. wanted to get your thoughts as well. When it comes to street art in Singapore, they're not necessarily the sort of, the, the venue that you would necessarily see uh, Singapore does mm. have some quite strict laws when it comes to mm. uh, sort of mm. the graffiti and things and things <laughs> like that. Uh, what are your thoughts on, is this sort of another way of presenting it in sort of a, a format uh, that could open doors to, to more sort of street art that could happen and take yeah, place in Singapore? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, Futura basically represents the best in class, mm. um, you know, through decades of experience and preservation. He's shown that if you are unique and you stay true to your, your artistic vision, it's possible to transition from the streets, so to speak, mm. into, into fine art practice for, for gallery showcases. Mm. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for both of you for coming in. Thank Wish you, you guys. Thank you so much. Welcome Thanks back. Thank, thank you, sir. You and thank you very much yeah, for having Just a us. reminder that uh, Futura's works go on display at the Gilman Barracks on Thursday.